My favorite part about the game is just the thrill and the brotherhood that I get to form. You know, I'm only a sophomore and it's been fun with them coming out every day with the coaches. Making plays and just celebrating with my teammates and winning. I can just go out there, have fun, and go hit somebody. Everything, I just love it. You know, just making contact. How competitive it is, I also love to hit. How physical it is. My favorite thing about the game is that I get to use my mental and my physical uh, attributes at the same time. Uh, it's my escape and I love to have fun. It takes my mind off things when I'm playing. My favorite thing about the sport is that I can have a chance to go to college and play for the rest of my life. De is unique because the, the environment that we've created between administration, athletics, and faculty. Um, it's one cohesive unit. We um, teach, have teachers that email us, coaches, to let us know if a kid is missing assignments or if a kid is achieving in the class. So we get the good news and the bad news, but we all work together to bridge the goal. Common goal is the kid. I don't like to hear what a kid can't do. More so, how can you help that kid achieve their goal? Goals for this year is to put up stats, get my name noticed, and, and just do as best as I can. My dream school is Stanford, uh, Stanford and Harvard, but you know, anywhere for education. A winning record goes to state. At least go for like 300 passing yards every game, trying to my best, and just leading my team for victory. I want to win the state, that's the goal. I want to get better too. At least 500 rushing yards, at least. Definitely win state this year. To get up for a game, I'm, I'm always ready to go, especially with this group. They make it exciting. I got to be like happy and in a good mood. So if I'm, if I'm like that, then I'll really be, you know, playing good. I'll be pumped up. Uh, I listen to music. That's how I lock in. I like rap music, Kai Benji. You know, I listen to Youngboy a little bit more. J. Cole. Yeah, Lil Durk or King Vaughn. And be a young boy, that really gets me into it. I like to isolate myself and think mentally and envision the game and what's going to happen in the future. I like to listen to music and, you know, do a prayer before the game. I talk to my older brother. He, he played football all the time, so I just talk to him. He just makes sure I'm in the right mindset. We got a solid team this year, playing, hoping to do big things. I love this team. I don't want to make this last year count. Uh, I love the team. These are, like, really my brothers, and the coaches are, like, father figures. The team's actually pretty good. I like how it's going. We have a very positive mindset, and, like, we always uplift each other, and I really like that about this team. I'm grateful to be on this team, honestly. You know, they're all my brothers. I love them to death, and I feel like we can win it all this season. It's going to be a good season for us, a great season. I'd like to shout out to the coaching staff and my little brother who also plays in the game, Desmond Sparks. I love him, man. Shout out to the coaching staff and my mother and everybody that supported me. My mom, uh, none of this would be possible without her, and I love her. Just shout out to my family and my friends. I, I want to shout out my coaches and my family. Shout out my family and my coaches, and especially my wrestling coach for always pushing me to be the best. Shout out my mom, my sisters. I'd like to shout out my brother and my father for standing right next to me this whole journey, and then also my mom. My coaching staff and my mom. My father and my brothers. I want to shout out my mom and my coaches and God for just giving me the strength and be able to play this. Shout out my mom, you know, she make everything possible for me, so shout out my mom most definitely. Shout out to like my great aunt, my grandmother, my mother, my brother, you know, my partner, CJ. The main thing I'm hammering in this year is togetherness and what is your why? Why do you do this? Why do you get up and practice? What is your end goal with the team? Run your own race. Don't really let anybody, elect their, unless they're your coaches, but don't really let nobody dictate where you, where you go, where you end up. Because it's important to follow your own judgment. Stand up! Stand firm! Make it love! Ready? Begin!